Now, we've been following the developments in Ecuador, and as predicted by President Rafael Correa, the opposition's call for mobilization and a national strike has failed. The turnout was low, and some who did participate in the anti-government rally in the capital, Quito, resorted to violence. The perception is that Ecuador's opposition has lacked valid arguments for their actions, which are mainly being described as destabilization attempts. In contrast, many more people turned out to, the, to a spontaneous demonstration of support for President Correa. Today, we supposedly face marches, uprisings, strikes, and Quito, the motherland, hasn't even felt it because millions of Ecuadorians went to work with greater determination, with much more love for the new motherland. Thank you, beloved Ecuador.